It was the first time I met Autry. It was through the film. And it was very informative. It was very well done. And I have to say, just in, in the brief encounter that I just experienced, she's a very knowledgeable, more than knowledgeable. She had so many insights. She had so much information that was on point to share with the world. Yeah. And it was very informative. I enjoyed every minute that I sat there. I found it very intense. In fact, I took my phone and I started recording mm. some of the things that she was saying after I sat there and realized the, the power that she had. Well, I had never heard of the poet and I was very fascinated by her life. And when she read some of her poems, I thought they were beautiful. Uh, poems can become so complicated, and she was so direct in her poems that I instantly thought I should buy a copy of her poems. I was inspired by her because she's a very intelligent woman. Uh, I first learned about her through you and uh, Erica, okay? And uh, you, you know, Erica told me a lot about her, you know, mm -hmm. but I didn't get the feeling or the connection as far as what she meant to y'all, you know. Uh, I didn't know that until I saw the film, okay. Uh, I understand what was going on there in Germany because it went on here in the States as far as people not being together, connectedness, and they're in their an ocean, you know, and with no one to cling on to, you know. And that with Audrey Lloyd, when she came about, she brought them together, you know. She was just like a Dr. Martin Luther King, you know. I didn't realize the life that people were living after that over in Germany. I was so caught up in my own life here in the United States, thinking that no one else is experiencing or have a history that blacks have gone through in America before. I was very um, surprised to know the large amount of blacks that lived in Germany and how they were organized. And their problems were very similar to what we have in our country. Uh, I don't know why it surprised me, but I thought it was it was an eye-opening experience. And just watching that movie, it allowed me to realize that my world is too small and that the same thing had been taking place in other locations. And I can understand and I feel for those who have experienced that. Uh, she was a big draw point for them and I felt that in the film. And I felt that with you guys, you know. Uh, not only was she articulate and whatnot, what I liked about her, I like personally women who can express themselves and you know, articulate themselves, you know. And, uh, and she was a leader too, you know, and flamboyant. And, you know, I liked her, you know, her style, you know, how she was funny and serious at the same time, but not taken seriously, you know. Mm. Uh, you know, I... Uh, I reflected on that and I reflected on the people, you know, not only white and black, how they saw her. Uh, and I can see why they loved her, liked her so much, you know, uh, because she was a real person, she was down to earth, and, uh, you know, just real. I found the different types of people that she interviewed and talked to um, reflected different sides of of life in Germany that I was totally unfamiliar with. And even though I have been to Germany when I was younger, um, I didn't realize that so many of those problems still exist. And it was very informative to see the strength that these women show. Everyone, and I noticed, I said, well, look, I told Larry, I said, Larry, they're highly intelligent. Everybody's well educated. And not only did they take that information and their education, they just didn't regurgitate it and say, I can, I can be a parrot and repeat what I know and been learned through an institution. They was creative in order to build a structure 
And I, I noticed that in the film, it's an institution that was just being developed. And I watched it in the morning and I was, I was just amazed at how they did it. They used the word, your power, your self-empowering. And a lot of times you hear that and you don't really understand what it means. But when you watch the film, it demonstrates it and it shows you what self-empowering is all about. You get a better guess. Mm -hmm. I enjoyed it. It was tremendous. I thought she was very bright, very intelligent, um, uh, very insightful, beautiful woman. And uh, you can could see her sincerity in everything that she was doing. Um, it was a fascinating film. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, I will probably get her essays to find out more of her thoughts. I believe the film opened with her explaining what poetry is. And I thought I had never heard such a concise definition of poetry. Mm -hmm. And I, it was beautiful, beautiful. A film is good, you know, you can feel the, the crowd, the pretty people in there, the room was quiet, you know. And I, I can feel people thinking and being introspective, you know. And, uh, you know, that was the, the film, you know, and I like that, you know. And, uh, you know, it gave me a better understanding of her. I think uh, young people would gravitate toward it. And especially in the uh, Chicago community. Uh, where there are so many young blacks that are so destructive nowadays. Uh, she was very peaceful. Um, I think they need to hear her message and try to solve some of their own problems. But she was constantly searching. and. Um, I thought it was excellent, excellent film. I would have liked to know her and met her, you know. And uh, that's all yeah. I can say. Mm. Well, thank you, Brad, thank you. Brad, Brad, it was, it was thank a real you. nice, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a, and, yeah. And, and, and so to summary, it's, it's not about different races, it's the human race. Right. Yeah. You know, and yeah. so that's what we got to think of. Yeah. Humanity.